last time we were sitting here, <laughs> we, we had just witnessed the Engendro Masterclass in Orlando. Yeah, and I had a bad feeling in Kasekan Lake. And we saw bad things in Kasekan Lake. Lake. Um, 12 wins in a row. First time ever in the PSL era beating Chiefs back to back. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we, we, why are we normalizing this? It's, it's, we're not 12 wins in a row is not a level, yeah, what we've seen in the, in the country before. So, we, re records are meant to be broken. Records are meant to be broken. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but it's not, um, I don't know, it's a God given right to win. It's not, it, it's, it hasn't been done for forever. I don't think, has it, yeah, like you said, the rec uh, record. It's a new record. Yeah. The last time uh, we won 11 in a row, I think it was 2006. 12. Yeah, uh, surprise Murillo era. Imagine, that's a generation ago. That's a generation ago. I won 15. Why? Why not? Okay, you tell me why Ukasinya can win 15 in a row. No, I, I, obviously, uh, Gary can win 20 and 25 and. But yes, yes. You know why I want to win 15? To answer your question. Kenya got to break the 71 points record. I won that. Oh, we had this conversation last. Mm. Uh, when we played. I. So. We, we, why not? This. Uh, Neo always brings up the fact that. We have the best squad now than the squad that won the Champions League. Neo says this is the best squad we, we've had. And it's a fact. Because you could only bring Teko off the bench. You could only bring Anthony Lafour. If Lafour is playing, you bring on Temba off the bench. You. But other than that, you could bring on uh, Malajila. Now you can bring on Gaston from the bench. You can bring on Sipombudi of the bench. You can bring on Ralan. You can bring on Domingo. You can bring on Savreda. Don't forget Savreda is a Bolivian international. I, I agree that we have a better squad. So why wouldn't you want to break the records that we set? And also, how sweet is it to break your own records? Yeah, true. True. I don't know. I get to work in a couple of you know, but yeah, you, feel, you know why? Because it scares you. Yeah, it, it does. It, uh, <laughs> it scares I, you. I, I, but this team is so good. I, it, if there were, if we had a, a team, it's it's this team. But I think we're still not where we like. We are not playing it at our true potential yet. Yes, I agree with you. We are not there yet, but we we we, we will get there. But we are so good. We are so 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 good. Um, like like play in intensity arena. It we we, we play like. Uh, Pep Guardiola said something about Arsenal. He said they make the last action like it's their last action of their lives. There and now we play. <laughs> we, we pass like it's. We press. We run. We run like we are not almost twenty points uh, ahead of everyone. We run better than everyone. We run. Be it's it's intensity and it is another thing that people do, like people will talk or hey, sometimes because win because of one two three, but do you know there's so many reasons why you win. Mm -hmm. One of those reasons is fitness. Like this team is yes. so fit, yes. and this team runs. Yeah, you look at Neo Mayem. Neo Mayem at any other team or a player like Mayem would be a luxury player. Yeah, like he'd be a, a luxury player. Um, but at Sundowns, he runs like yeah. mad. He, he, all of them. Well, we've got. Probably, not probably, okay, uh, Bafana back five, like we said the last time, mm -hmm. but they run uh, Bafana midfield, Ba, Allen, the Temba, they run like they are number 14th on the log, not number one, and however many points is ahead of the second place, we run like our lives depend on it. It's ridiculous, no? Yeah. That first half, um, I think... One of the best halves I've seen. Um, 
Coach Rudan, after the Super Sport game, he spoke about how we were not close enough to the opposition strikers to drag them out. And like, you, know, you could see they were so intentional, guy on because Tibbs are like, at every given moment, he was asking the guys to push up, to push up. Did you see where Ronan was? Yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it, things, boy. It was yeah. ridiculous. I don't want to lie to you. It was ridiculous. Um, but to be clear, I'm not going to say that to give you. I know. Thanks. Um, um, nah, I don't want to lie. The coach Rudani says the positive is the fact that we won, we beat Chiefs. For me, nah, the pos- the biggest positive is the um, we were so intentional with the first half. Like it, it was, we were so intentional with the first half. Like it. It looked good. It, 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 it did look good. Uh, it did look out of this world. Uh, even the second half, I don't think it was that bad. I don't personally think it was that bad. Yeah, I think the only thing that I had a problem with the second half is how the, the control we had the first half, it wasn't there. Mara, I'm thinking Tibza has been playing back to back games. I get it for how long? Like since Rubu won the Little Pirates against like Teti, he's how, played every game. How good is he? Um, if the home corner is still in the PSL next season, or maybe I might say who like he will have reached his limit next season. If this boy, I'm hoping we get to play with that or Raja in the Champions League, so that we can have um, the scouts coming to watch the the Moroccans and uh, discover same way Coach Pizzo went to scout Alimeza and he saw mm-hmm. Gaston and he sent Gaston first mm-hmm. who was playing for the opposition team I'm hoping we play the Moroccans so the scouts who are coming there to watch the Moroccans can spot Tebza um, Tebza is two years ahead of like he's two years late should be playing Kobo to lose I, I said it before Hore. If when Yesham Munyeti are playing that side, I hope he's a good agent. He's, <laughs> I hope he's a good Debs agent. A, he's been a phenomenal player for us this season. Uh, too good. Midfield of the season. Uh, is it is it too soon to? Be, no. Is it too soon to be having conversations? No. About, I even know that your question. No. About about Debs of Kukwena, football of the season. For me. Is the number one contender for football of the season. He should be. Yeah, nah. He should be. Ronwen Um I think Shika's performances. Mm-hmm. Shika might not have you know they 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 judge Atika's carry goals and assists. Mm-hmm. But for me, I think Tembali and big shot for player of the season. Naomi and Alan they think are knocking as well. But but Tepzam is, is for me right now. If the league ends today, we're not gonna COVID, we're going to feel like a match. If the league, yeah. league ends today, the Womb Gwena is player of the season for me. Yeah, I, I agree with you. I, I can't speak or I don't have the right uh, to describe how good he's been um, since he came into that role. We played, even if, even the Wala Adala, the eight, uh, box to box, this role, I, I can't speak high enough of how good he, he's been. And how, like the good work he's, he's, he's doing more that role. He's incredible. I, every time to my level, uh, yeah, wow. You know how good Tibza has been? The midfielder, last season's midfielder of the season, is wearing flip flops and basking in the sun and headfield that level is a tax. That's how good Tibza has been. It's kept AJ out. There might be other factors that are keeping AJ out, but. Tibza's performances. I mean, they could say, hey, favoritism in King. No, you can't even say a thing. Gaudi favoritism and whatnot. It, it, it's, it's there for everyone to see. He's clear, he's clear, clear, clear as the number one, I think, midfielder in not just Mamelis and Nelson, the country. I think so. I think he's the number one. Um, <laughs> I think he's the number one uh, midfield in the country. Banan. Nah, I say to you guys, let's go into the Champions League and then maybe might be on the continent. I can't. <laughs> I can't. I'm, 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 I'm blown away by 
a player. He's we've all seen him got passport and yeah. how good he was. Le Femen, Le Mukoele, Mbulen that midfield. Yeah. But I think he stepped up a level. He's, yes, he's he stepped definitely. up a level. It's like now. It's like he was. Uh, it's like he had roommates. It's like he was living in a commune because mm-hmm. of because he had the he had Femen, Limbu, Le Mola, and they were sharing the workload. Oh no, no, no. And that um, single pivot, it's like it's moved in his own house. Yeah. <laughs> sensational. Yeah. What a sensational player. Um, I wanted to say something to Vukere. If the Bolivian, the uh, Chilean FA, if they're serious about their footballers, someone should write, I give it to who, and ask, how is a player of this level playing in the South African League? I need to understand. I just saw Twitter appeal and I know it's it's unfortunate that Marcelo has to come here and play the book unique. I fully agree. You know, this boy is twenty three years and he's playing like this. We, if there's two players whose time we are wasting, the boom going and Marcelo Allen. Yeah. These guys should go play in Europe. Yeah. Uh, 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 they are that good. Too good. They are that good. Like, Alain De, I, I thought uh, he needed the rest when I never said no way. Not today, not, not today. No and you saw why? Yeah, I did. In the first 40, 45 minutes. Maravara is a good thing. Yeah. Sorry, but yeah, you were saying? Uh, in the first 40 minutes, I thought he was. You know, the tapes are. Actually, Lushika. Very good player. You know, Athazwane, you can't do that to such a young boy. That's one boy. Yeah. You're gonna put that boy up against literally three diamonds, like three yeah. gems yeah. in the midfield. Like, Mfanalo was supposed to compete with Lebo Marcel. I think um, if I talk too much about this game, I feel like I think I, I need to watch it. Like if I if I talk too much, I'm gonna look back and carry. I, I was crazy. But 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 you can not praise the first half performance. Mm. Uh, actually, the, the second half just said she said chances here and there. Mm. But the best team was clear. The best team was clear on the pitch tonight. Another thing, I was very happy got the starting lineup. You, I think you got it, hundred percent. Because I told you now, I'll start Mvala and Grant, and then I'll start Shalili ahead of Sirin. and that's exactly how we started. Um, one thing I I bemoan Kajin is the fact that we didn't. The the Mbule sub was too late today. I feel like because level in the past two games, Mbule like has brought control to midfield and to the midfield, and I think that's why we we won those games in the fashion that we did. Like it wasn't catching uh, it was squeaky bumnya. Yeah, and I think like the control had gone, and I think there was nothing um, Mbule could do. But I. Okay, maybe we'll talk about it in the ratings. Kajuna was impressed with Gaston. Uh, it, it? Great performance. Yeah. Great when performance. It's, 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 it, it was different from the last performance. Uh, yeah. Today he looked like... He looked like... He looked like... He looked like... He looked Let's go into the ratings. Look. Ronway. How many pieces? Lost count. Um, seven. Seven. Um, I saw they gave Kulis a man of the match. Was he your man of the match? Huh? Was he your man of the match? No. I don't think I'm going to my man of the match. If I'm lucky enough to read my man of the match. I think uh, Kulis, but I think Kulis was good. Was good. Okay. Uh, Eight. Defender of the season. I'm no longer talking about it. Eight. 
Gomme le moke kan. An eight. An eight le. Yeah. Mm. He's, he's, he's a leader in this team. He he can mash, marshals the defense. He he organizes very well. Uh, off the ball, drop up the press. Let the drop or the press. He's 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 been. I don't know. He was. He looked like he belonged, not belonged, but he looked like, yeah, he belonged in the Champions League team. And he loves the challenge. <laughs> he loves the challenge. Um, if there's a 50-50 ball, guaranteed Grant is going to fight for that ball. Another thing, you know what I've always said to you, Grant, I was so scared because for a player who wasn't commanding like a starting berth, Kosovo spot, I was afraid with Grant to probably imposter syndrome. But... Um, I think the coaching has gotten puts and downs and also the confidence that they instilled in him, I think it has helped so much. Yeah. I agree, I agree with your rating. Mvala seven. Okay. Okay. Nigga try Nigiri the chief striker, Caleb. He didn't get a sniff and they tried to I think the first two minutes, but try to um, target the home person. But mm. after that, he he was big again, monstrous again. Mm. He looked comfortable. Mm. Yeah, I think Aubry had a better second half. Even though, like in the first half, I don't think he was bad. Um, one thing I've realized is that sometimes Aubry gets the hospital pass, and people blame him mm. for what he does with the ball. And I think I saw it like twice. But also, I understand that the attackers have to use the, the full backs as a shield and also as um, uh, almost like they have to use them as cones sometimes. Mm -hmm. Like, it's either they recycle the ball and look for, new, for, for and try to create space, or they use them as a dam. You know, like Golia Neomayema. Not even Golia Neomayema. The, uh, the Golia Peter Shalrile, when we played Chiefs. Mayama um, had the ball, and then uh, uh, was it Obri? Yeah, it was Obri who made a run, and then Mayama fainted as if Odomo Pasa, and then gave it to Shika, and then Shika turned, and then Shabir Shabba first time got left. So I guess it's one of those things where the fullbacks have to understand. Yeah. Um, Obri, I think Lena is seven. Seven, definitely. Yeah. 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 Definitely. Uh, Tibza. Can I read Tibza? Please. 8.5. 8. I don't know why I'm not giving him a 9. I think, I thought he was very, 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 very good. Uh, Tibza, oh, he blew me away. He got Chiefs away, boy. I, for, or maybe sentimental or whatever reason, mm. but Chiefs away uh, to do that. 8.5. For, for, every, one nine. for every Sundown supporter, I don't want to lie to you, there is no three points that feels as sweeter as three points against Chiefs away. Yeah. That's the best three points yeah. you can ever get. Um, Marcelo Allende, eight. Ah, uh, Marcelo, man. Now, like I've said to you, and I think I've said it here, like if we're not sitting here in two years and say, remember Marcelo really? played at Sundowns? You know how we used to see Siakati and go PSG and yeah. I think Marcelo like that's a good reference actually. Uh, I think we have to look back three to four years and just laugh at the audacity of this team to go <laughs> and sign that boy. Yeah. Um well, when we were shooting the season review with Coach Rula, he said, Kent, if we get this guy, if we get this guy you will just see. And he's such a top player. Yeah, um, yeah I, th I think he's the one signing that I know for sure that they pushed so hard to, to get. Like, he's the one signing that they pushed so hard to get. And I'm so happy they did. I'm so happy they did. Um, Neoma Yema. Eight. Eight. Yeah. Yeah. He was much winner, but overall he was was very good. Yeah, it was extremely good. Timber 8.5. Yeah. Uh, you asked me about my middle of the match again. Yeah. Now my, my candidate for middle of the match was Timber Zwal. And then 
my my and Marcel. Uh, okay, my candidates were oh yes, that three. Temba, Mayema, Masir. She comes. Ah, she come in. Ah, she come in. No ways, guys. Ah, no ways, guys. No ways. Um, I wouldn't be mad if she wins football of the year. I really wouldn't be. The thing is that I, sh I wish we could give football of the year by just looking at what a player does and what a player brings. Not numbers and. But she got like an aura. The aura, like it's just the aura, but the ability is just his his, his ability and his decision making. Wow, Tambazwan is an elite footballer. The country should be appreciating, and yeah, Tambazwan is almost okay. Eight point five. Eight point five. Uh, I you, you won't be crazy to say he was the best player on the pitch. Definitely the best player on the pitch. I think the football smiles when it's at Timber's feet. Yeah. Because, uh, like, the football is, is, is at home mm -hmm. when it's in Timber's feet. Mm -hmm. um, wow. Kalambas was finest son. <laughs> what a footballer. What a footballer. Uh, I think Peter was good without the goal. Yeah. I think he was good. Kaja knew, like, it was since Abu, Abu from. I know he scored against Chipa, but I think today was his first good performance. Also, got an assist. Yeah. yeah, yeah, but also the you must credit. Sorry to go back, but now that I think about it, you must credit Kuliso for the goal. Yeah, uh, yes, you must credit. Remove Luke again, Kuliso. I think we gave him a, a, a seven. So Reneo, I think we're gonna go back. I think no, no, no. Remove an eight. Kuliso. Yeah, I think we must upgrade Kuliso to an eight point five. No, he was good. Yeah, uh, Kuliso was. We didn't actually discuss how, how good he was. He was <laughs> and he was very good. Yeah. Like especially in the first half, everything good about us started with Kulis. And by but the right side, the right side that achieves their shanty and we used we, we used it very well. But Grant was good cover for Kulis. Was a good cover. This team was so good. This team was so good. Yeah. Um, Shalu, seven and a half. Okay. If you look, if you look at Kamro, she now Kashalu like um. Is that Shalu? I think Kimo Rita, not trying to be biased because of what I love about him so much. But if it's too low, tell me in the comments. I know you'll tell me if you know on Twitter, but so seven, seven and a half. Okay. I think. I think that's a good, good rating. Yeah. My lord. Seven. Seven. Do you want to touch some funnel? That boy knows how to eliminate a defender. Do you he see does. that? He does. There's a chance I'd create the thing on. I think that was in the second half. Yeah. I was inside the team. He created. But, but there's the other one where the ball came. And with his first touch, Anta Edmilson Dove, like, immediately. Seven, yeah. Um, I think Gaston was very good. I think Gaston was good off the bench, catch it. He was. He and was. nearly scored a, a. If that goal had got in, that was. It was going to be a world with goal. Can I please read Gaston? Because I've been so hard on him. Seven and a half. That good. I think he was very good. I think. The type of control we've been getting from Sipo, Kajano Regrilo from Gaston. Gaston. Yeah. yeah but I also, Gaston, I think, he's always motivated to play a big game. Especially Chiefs. Chiefs. Sometimes, like, he fades away, but he loves the game against Chiefs. He does. Yeah. He does. He does. Um, There's so much noise now. <laughs> so sorry about that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, who else came off the bench? Sipo Booth. And Sabreda was Oh, Sabreda, yes. At the same time, we see. Um, Pola, six and a half. Okay. I think they both. Um, Sabreda, six. Six. Yeah. Okay. And then Blessa, Le Tapelo. I don't think it was enough. I don't think so. Uh, it wasn't enough. I don't think so. Yeah. Kushu, then? Eight. Eight. 
Mas anda o ano onde está o ten. Exceptional again. On form. On form. Are you are you happy with this yeah. review? It's over. Eight. That's it. Only eight, ne? Yeah. I think it's a good rating. I was gonna give him the same rating. Same rating. Yeah. yeah. Right. That we'll see in the next game. Hopefully, um, we we'll see you uh, the Chess Galaxy game, but it's a tricky one, that one. But yeah, let's let's enjoy this one. Like Coach Rooney said, let's let's enjoy it and then flush it out of our systems and move on. But winning and win, like he said, we can't get tired of this this feeling. It, it can't be tiring. No. Let's guys, let's, let's celebrate this team as much as we can. It's not normal, guys. Every every given chance. Thank That's you. it. Thank Bye. You.